Hi everyone! My name is Amanda and today I will be giving you my April TBR. So like I said in my last video, I would split up my wrap up and my TBR into two videos because they would be too long. So today I will be showing you the books I'm planning on picking up in April. And there are just so many books that I want to read right now, it's crazy. So I have just picked out the ones I want to read the most and hopefully I will get through them all in this month. So I've actually already read one book this month and that was Allegiant by Veronica Roth and I have some mixed feelings about this book but I don't hate it as much as everyone else do. I don't think the ending was unworthy as my friend said last week. I actually think it was a very worthy ending. But I will talk more about this in my wrap up so if you want to know more thoughts about it then you'll have to wait a month and then you'll know. The other books will be in no particular order. I have no idea which one to pick up first. If you want me to read a special one first then tell me in the comments because I have no idea which one to choose. So sometime this month I will try to pick up The Night Circus by Erin Morgenstern because I've wanted to read this book for ages and it's really not my genre and I really want to branch out and read more adult books. So this one I think will be a great choice and I've heard loads and loads and loads of great things about it and I've no really clue what it's about except that it's a night circus and it's supposed to be really good characters and world setting and all that kind of stuff but I am really excited. On the line with branching out of my comfort zone, I will also try to read a non-fiction book this month and it is Escape from Camp 14 and it is by Blaine Harden and it is a non-fiction book about a boy living in a concentration camp in North Korea and his escape from this camp and it's just supposed to be a really really good story and a friend of mine has read it and he loved it so really high hopes for this one. Moving back into the young adult section, I really want to read The Raven Boys by Maggie Stiefvater because this is one of those books that I just wanted to read for so long and it seems like everyone has already read this book except me and I don't know. I have no idea what this book is about so I'm going in totally blind and that's fine with me because sometimes you just have to do that and it often tends to make the book even better so I hope this one lives up to the hype. Yeah, the next book I want to pick up is Scarlet by Marissa Meyer. This is the sequel to Cinder which I read last month and I just loved it and I need more of this world in my life right now because it is just so unique and so good. I'm just so excited to pick up this book. I can't even tell you guys, so I will definitely be reading this this month. I have two more books to show you and I'm sure that I won't be able to read seven books, but I mean, better to aim high, right? The next book I am planning on reading is Half Bad by Sally Green and yeah, this has been a lot of hype around this book on booktube lately. It came out not too long ago and I've just heard a lot of mixed reviews about it, mostly great things though. And I'm sure everyone out there knows what this book is about, but in case you don't, it is about a boy and he lives in London and there are witches and there are good witches and bad witches. He is half bad, one parent is bad and one parent is good. He is not really accepted by either side and he just has to do a bunch of stuff to get into his powers, I think. And it's supposed to be really good and I hope it is. So the last book I want to pick up this month is The Immortal Rules by Julie Kagua. And it is because the third and final book comes out really, really soon. And everyone keeps telling me that this series is so good and I love vampires and if I like it I'll definitely go and buy the second and third book as soon as it comes out 
and I just want more vampire books because I do really love them. So that was a mouthful, I know, but hopefully I'll be able to read most of these books because I just feel like I am in such a great reading mood right now and I don't know, I just want to read all the books. Please tell me in the comments which one I should pick up first and also tell me what you will be reading in April. I would love to know, it's always so interesting. If you enjoyed this video, please give it a big thumbs up because that would help me out a lot. Do not forget to subscribe and I'll see all of you guys in my next video, so stay tuned. Bye!